I, I'm not a tiptoe kind of coach, which means I like to just play it straight and I like to say it very simple. So when individuals are recognizing, I'm having a hard time, I'm going to try not to say it like that because that's kind of being condescending, mm -hmm. not kind of, it's being condescending. I know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a hard time moving to action. In essence, underneath that is often playing the role of victim. So I say the first thing to acknowledge is, and ask yourself the question, am I playing the role of victim? Mm -hmm. Is it within, because the second question is, yes, I'm playing the role of victim. If that's the answer, then you have to ask yourself, are you enjoying that role? Mm -hmm. And if you aren't enjoying the role, that can be motivation enough to shift. If you ask yourself the question, am I playing the victim? No. <laughs> So what do I want to do about it? Well, I'm, I'm going to start taking action towards those things that I want to do. Where do I start? I think it's easiest to always ask, well, where's the biggest bang for my buck? So where am I derailing myself the most? Let me start there. And let me just start by tweaking the dial a little bit at a time. When we did that circles exercise, it's not about get me to Z in one fail swoop. It's about, I'm going to go from A to capital A. <laughs> Cause you know, in grade school, we had the alphabet up in the room. It was like yeah. little A, big A, little B, big B. That's, That's right. what you're aiming for. Tweak the dial. And so once we decide what's the biggest bang for my buck, then I think the second thing is who, help, who can help me? Like who's around me to help? And who do I feel comfortable asking for help? And what kind of help do I actually need from them? Because when we approach people and ask them, for their help, whether we're looking for a coach, we're looking for a mentor, we're just looking for a confidant, we're looking for a friend, we're looking for a tribe, a cohort, a team of people. We have to let them know the role that they need to play for us. So we have to know what that role is. Today I need a listener. Tomorrow I'm gonna need a problem solver. And if it happens to be the same person, I gotta make sure I say, hey Brian, today I just need listening. Tomorrow I'll be ready to go to problem solving. And so tomorrow we'll do problem solving. You're like, cool, I know what my responsibility is. Sit back and listen. Tomorrow, lean in and talk about solutions. 